history of Kia. So Kia is a South Korean international car automobile company. So they have plants on a lot of countries. So they have plants on USA, they have it on Germany, Europe, and then Mexico, China, India, Pakistan. So in this year, they did their two new plants at India and Pakistan. So this Kia Saltos that we are going to do the review on, that has been launched at India but it has been manufactured by Kia, the Korean, South Korean company. So this is a little bit of history, so let's not bore you with the history, let's start the review. So guys, this car comes with three engine variants. So there's first the 1.4 liter diesel manual transmission, and there's the 1.5 liter petrol engine with seven speed transmission and a six speed transmission. And then the international model, that's this, the 1.6 liter naturally aspirated six speed transmission so the 1.4 liter and the 1.5 liter are for home country that's india and the 1.6 liter is for the international export so that's a little bit more history now let's go to the review hey guys welcome back to today's video today we're reviewing the 2020 kia salto so let's get started Of the Kia Seltos over here. So now let's show you the headlight and the grill. So let's unlock the car first. So this is the headlights. So let's turn on the headlights first. So there you go. The headlights are here. So you can see these are this is the daytime running light. So it starts from here it all the way goes goes and goes and goes and it stops over here so in the middle there's a little bit of shiny chrome and then it goes again to the left, other headlight and then you can see this full grill actually i really like this grill with this gloss black and this chrome it actually matches in my opinion and over here you can see there's a hazard and this is your headlight it has four little tube that's really when you turn on the full headlight it actually looks really good so the headlights are really fancy and then you, the antiquities are really good. These are the fog lamps. So these look like really nice ice cubes actually. And they are actually really bright. So you can see in this lighting also these are very like the fog lamps of the car. You can see it looks like three ice cubes over here and that's really nice. And then you can see there's a diffuser down here. This red paint actually looks really nice. This is the tow hook. And then there's the air intake for the radiator. And then there's a nice diffuser. So now let's show you what is under this hood so guys let's show you that what's under this hood so let's open this hood first there you go the hood is open this is a 1.6 liter naturally aspirated engine it makes 128 horsepower you can see there's the engine right here one two three four four cylinders if you want you can just do this there you go, the engine is in the struts, and this is for the lock. And now, get a close view of the engine. So 
this is the interior of the car so i'm gonna start from the passenger seat seat and you can see there's this nice trim so i really like this piano black and this nice effect of the car and then you can see the ac vents ac vents ac vents this is the gear novel and let's show you in a close view and another camera angle for starting the car you just keep the key on the cup holders or your pocket press on the brake press the start button there you go the engine is starting so this is your entertainment system over here so you can, it has apple carplay and android auto let's go to media and it has apple car and android auto like every single car now and this is the infotainment system it has real buttons and it's also a touch screen and this is the infotainment system this is for your ac to turn on your ac you just press on ac there you go for changing your temperature you do this and for changing your temperature this is for auto if you don't want auto you just turn it off there you go the auto's off and yeah this is your for climate control and stuff this is for keeping the ac inside the car this is for it's gonna go on your legs or your feet or something and then let's turn this off turn the air condition off and then you can see there's a usb right here for your apple carplay there's a charging socket there's a cigarette lighter and then you could keep your phone here and there's really piano black over here and then this is for your drive select so it has normal and that's i'm going to show you in the close view and now i'm going to show you so it has First, it has sport. Okay, wait, let's go to it. has sport. Then it has eco, normal. Then snow. Snow, then mud, and then sand. So it has off road button. So let's keep it on sport. And then you can see the RPM, the speedo is over here, the fuel. And now let's turn off the car real quick. And then you could lower the brightness of the screen and then brighten it up that's another cool feature attraction control off attraction control on and now let's turn off the car so let's show you more features about this car so it has two cup holders here's the key of the car this is a brand new car by the way the storage space over here with the manual of the car from Kea. You can keep your manual again over here and then close it. It has a little storage area over here. And then it has a sunroof. So let's open the sunroof because it has a sunroof. It's an automatic sunroof. So if you just press a button, it's going to open. Press a button, it's going to close. And then it has a shade for you that's manual. So you can close it. And then it has lights over here and lights in the back. And you can turn this off and just turn on the front and let's just keep the light and then it has a sunglass holder well wow, that's a nice thing and it's actually very soft over here to so not put your sunglass here and scratch it and now let's show you the back seats and more features about this car so guys here's the doors of the car the speakers are really nice like look at that design bro the speaker then the twitters up here it has shiny plastic over here that's really it's really good quality to be every single car has this for the, your mirror windows and your lock windows it has storage area over here there's a button over here to open your fuel cap there you go the fuel caps open this is for your hood this is your accelerator and thing attraction control start button now let's show you the back seat now let's show you the back seats. And by the way, if you lock the car, the mirror is automatically closed. If so, this is on your pocket. There you go. It opens, and then if you want to close it, and then press the button again, it's gonna lock. And now let's show you the back seats. The so back seats, it has that nice design. Speaker over here, cup, cup, more storage area, storage area, and the back seats. So let's start. It actually has a lot of legroom, like a lot. Airplane style storage. And then over here you have a center armrest. Over here with cup holders that you can put your hand here. So these seats are fabric, so if you want to get the leather seats, you have to go for the higher trim. Higher trim. 
So I'm gonna show you in the close view that what are the difference with the higher trim and the lower trim. So now let's show you the back seats. So before we do that, look at these. These are cool features of this car. It has railings on the roof that helps you some times whenever you drive the car. And now let's show you the back, the back lights and the boot. So guys, for opening the boot, you hold this button. It's gonna blink two times. The car's still locked, but the boot is open. There you go. So over here you can see you have a full size spare wheel. So whenever you go on a long drive on highways, you don't if something happens to your tires, nothing to do. You have a full size spare wheel, no tension. And then over here you can see is your emergency triangle. Keep this, put this, it has a lot of room. So I can actually fit fit here, like yeah, I can fit two size, two children like me can fit in here. And then it has this like in my CHR video, it has this also in Bangladesh, everyone just keeps their tissue paper over here. Yeah, now let's show you the back light. So I'm gonna go and turn on the back light real quick and you guys can stay here. design on it and then this is your indicator because I turned on the hazards and then yeah that backlights are actually really nice if you put it on reverse a white light turns on over here and then it has chrome that goes to the other side it has a spoiler and a spoiler light then it has a windshield wiper and the diffuser let's show you the diffuser so the diffuser is actually very nice it helps for aerodynamic and it has back sensors so if another guy comes closer than you it's gonna beep inside and now let's show you the fuel cap because you know I just opened it in the beginning. Here's the fuel cap, a little nice design too. And for closing it, there you go, close. It has chromey shine finish over here in the door trims. And now we're done with the car review. Let's go to the close view.